Good morning, St. Charles Borromeo. Today is Wednesday, January 20th. Let's begin the day with prayer. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord Jesus, in your victory over sin and death on the cross and in your resurrection, you give us assurance of sharing in the eternal rest of heaven. Transform my heart with your love that I may freely serve my neighbor for his good and find joy and refreshment in the celebration of Sunday as the Lord's Day. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. And now please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now for a couple of quick announcements. Today we will be selling script at 245 from the food bank. Please stop by. A reminder that Catholic Schools Week begins on Sunday, January 31st, and registration for the next school year starts on Monday, February 1st for existing families and for new families. More details on both to follow soon. And now our saint of the day. Today we recognize Saint Sebastian. Son of wealthy Roman family, he was educated in Milan. He was an officer of the Imperial Roman Army and captain of the guard. During the persecutions of Christians, Sebastian visited them in prison, bringing supplies and comfort. Reported to have healed the wife of a soldier by making the sign of the cross over her. He converted soldiers and a governor to Christianity. He was eventually charged as a Christian and Sebastian was tied to a tree and shot with arrows and survived with the help of Irene, St. Irene. Eventually, Diocletian had him killed. He is the patron saint of plagues. And now this day in history. In the year 2009, Barack Obama is inaugurated as the 44th president of the United States of America becoming the United States' first African-American president. And now for my silly dad joke. Why are parades best in the spring? Because they're always on the march. And we end our day with a quote from Dr. Martin Luther King that says, our lives begin to end the day we become silent about things that matter. St. Charles Borromeo, pray for us. Have a great day, everyone. Peace.